Hi, this is Shane and welcome to episode 16 of Rustic Waters 2. And in the last episode, we went to the Dark Caverns, which is the mining dimension, and it's always dark, um, as, as you know, as the name implies. Um, I did make, let me see, I did go ahead and not those, where was it? Dark Caverns? Yeah, I made the novelty drinking hat. And I also made the feeder the feeder helmet module, and I put it on my um. I made a diamond helmet, and put it on that. But the dark caverns is always dark, and I don't want to be torching up the place all the time. And I thought I'll make another feed, another feeding module, and I want to put it on my crewman's cap. Okay, let's see. So I don't know whether it's going to work or not, but let's see. So I have all the things that I need. You need two straws, two jars, um, two straws, two jars, and a chef hat to make the novelty drinking hat. And then you need a redstone servo to turn the novelty drinking hat into an auto feeding module. So I think I have another redstone servo. Yes, because I have some from um, loot crates and stuff. So you put these two together. That gives you the feeding module. And then you craft this together with any helmet. So I'm guessing, yes, it was just in there. And now it has auto feeding mode. So, if I put this on, it should give me night vision. So that's all right for the, um, this place. What do you call it? I forget what it's called. Dark cabins. That's it. Right. Let us put that and that. Put the diamond helmet out here. Actually, I'll put it to, um, to charge while we're away. Purchase. I can take the bear cape out because I died like twice in quick succession and almost let me see back. Where's my bear cape? Yeah, I died like twice in quick succession and almost destroyed my stuff, so I had to put it all to charge. Right, let's go. I made a boomerang, by the way. I have no idea how it works, but I made a boomerang. I really, oh, there you go. See, now that we've got night vision on, it lights everything up so much better. Um. Oh, you know what? Cause I did go up to the surface. I started, um, I started digging my way out. Then I got bored and then I just went straight up and there is a surface up here but like i said it's just totally dark so the night vision makes it look like everything's just really foggy but it's not um there is you can get blazes out here there is this is lava yes magma blocks it's magma block is there any closer i don't think there's any closer all right, um, magma blocks. So, yeah, I died twice. <laughs> oh, we need a different color maybe? Change color? Yeah, dark blue could work. So, um, that's how many is. Okay, it's not too far. You have these, um, you have these blocks you've got these glimmer shroom blocks and they act you can bounce on them so if you jump on them you know if you if you jump and land then you don't damage yourself uh where are we going that way 
And also there are some kind of like these things. They are like um, little huts. How would you get in? There you go. And each one has the same thing. So you've got two luminite torches, two chests, a smithing table, anvil, grindstone, chest, all of this stuff. And the loot is all right. It's not brilliant. Anvil, I will always take because, you know, it's good. The other stuff, the grind, I, I don't know about the other stuff. So, um, so yeah, there's not much out here. There are beings you can trade with. Where are we going? That way. That way, right. There are things you can trade with. Um, I haven't, I think they use, they use luminite ore. So actually I need to, um, take some. Okay, we're going this way. Okay, that's shift. Okay, that's um kind of deep. I know one of the quests is to make a like a grappling hook and stuff, which we probably should have done. But you know what? It's, um, I'm kind of impatient and it looks a bit faffy to use, to be honest. Sorry, I'm here kind of concentrating on what I'm doing. Oh, look, there's one of the trader guys. Hello, sir. Shroomy. me. And that, and that's what Glimmershroom block, which we get free anyway, and those are free. Okay. Scorched berries. You can get those for free anyway. Okay. Alright, you don't have much. It's alright. Um. Okay. Uh, we want to go that way. Yeah, that was smart. That was very smart, Shay. Let's eat some of this bread. The auto feeding should should work, but for whatever reason, it doesn't seem to be. Or no, actually, no. I lied. That's not the that's not the correct thing. It tends to be quite slow. So. Oh. We need to go. That's the glimmer glass block. block. No, we want the sh glimmer shroom block. And where is my other? Oh, it's in my other hand. Maybe I should just um, nerd pull up. I think that might be better. Oh, there's blazes. There's a lot of blazes. You freaking kidding me? Ah, uh, okay. All right. I'm going to be silent for a minute. And we'll just speed up. Or not we. So, oh, is that lapis? I need some lapis. Through the magic of editing mojo stuff, I will speed up the process. I will get to the top. Do I have the Pokeball? Yeah, you have the Pokeball, because I'm here thinking, what absorption, what did I get absorption for? Probably something that it fed me, I don't know. Okay, yeah, so through the magic of whatever, I will, is that going to work? Probably not. I'm going to see if I can get up here and oh, we're here now. 
Pokeball. These things. Gotcha. All right, that's good. Um, yeah, those are the glimmer berries that you get for free. That I told you about. We've got lots of magma blocks. We've got stuff. Yeah, I don't think there's any other biomes really. There's like this magma biome thing. And then there's, um, is that where we're going that way? And then there's these blue mushroom biomes and that's it. Why? Oh. So yeah, now I'm going to go back to the portal. Oh, we're going to get back up. Let's see what's in here. Although it's probably going to be the same thing. Bread and stuff. Although we're getting quite a few um golden apples, which is good. So yeah, I will see you at the portal. Where is my portal? No, that's that way. We're going this way. Okay, back in the base. Um, we need to offload some stuff. And then, um, yeah, there's not much in the mining dimension, to be honest. Apart from, you know, stuff to mine. I mean, there are a few things that you can't get anywhere else. But other than that... All right, we need... Did we ever make the ba blaze burner? I don't think we did. Oh, yeah, we did. All right, uh, hold W to ponder. Um, okay, right-click a blaze with an empty burner to capture it. Okay, sun's coming up. Good, good. Let's go up and let's click on a blaze. I really should put um uh, elevator above the base. I'll get there eventually. Something I need to do between episodes. I didn't do much between episodes this weekend. I mean, it was Easter and ended up doing stuff with my family and didn't really... um. All right, uh, right click, there you go. Got you, did we get the Pokeball? Yes, we did, I'm being fed, that's awesome. Hi guys, you safe in there? Great, you having a good time? That's awesome, what about you? You safe in there? You not safe, are you? No? Yes, you are, okay. But you're having a great time, awesome, right. So you just got to make sure that they're okay and, you know, nothing happens to them. I wish I could have used my boomerang. I'd forgotten the boomerang. It comes back to you, but it doesn't work well in water, in which I guess is to be expected. But, um, yeah, just thought I'd put that out there. Okay, so blaze burner, you put that under the basin, right? All right, feeding blaze burners can provide heat to items processed in a basin. And the blaze has to be fed with flammable items. And with a blaze cake, the burner can reach an even stronger level of heat. Okay. So I guess... I guess I would have to make two mixers, one with a blaze burner, one without. I don't know. But anyhow, but we can use the blaze burner to make, um, what do you get? Oh, fire protection. That's nice. You can use that to make the, um, where is, let me see, dark caverns. Is it dark caverns? There was something that you need the Signalium stuff for. And you get that with the Blaze Burner. So there's that. Okay, anyway. Um, the copper chest, you get explosive arrows. Bottle of cloth and a common backpack. Okay, let's do that. Because I, I want to kind of finish some of these. I need to look for the track. Oh, Elytra. Okay, let's see if we can make that elytra then. Let me finish off this arc and make the elytra. So, and then I would consider that to be a good episode. Right, what well, do you want a copper chest? 
All right, a chest with copper around it. That works. Um, and do we have any chests in here? We should do. I mean, I've usually got loads. All right, copper chest. Now, what do we get? Explosive arrows. All right. Uh, four bolts of linen. I should still have some of those because I'm always making linen because you always need it. And we get chips and dip. That's nice. And a common backpack. I made a common backpack. Does it not recognize that I made one? Uh, buoy. But you can never have too many backpacks either. Okay, C O M M. All right, common backpack, copper chest, leather. Okay, let's get some leather. Let's dump the anvil in there. Okay, uh. Okay, that's done. And we get a bucket of creosote oil. All right, next thing. We want four tarantula hawk wings. Well, they say it's at night. Okay, um, nighttime, daytime. I don't know what it is. Right, let's put down the blaze burner. Don't need that right now. And let's go look for some tarantula hawks. Okay, see, I told you it was going to be like this. That when we want, we won't find. And I want the boomerang. Let's get close. Let's get nice and close. You don't want to get close, do you? Not that I blame you. Ah. Okay, can we appreciate how rubbish I am with the stupid boomerang? It just goes in a straight line. Okay. Oh, my days. All right, this has to be a better way to do this. You believe that? Do you believe that? I don't believe that. Okay, let me make a new boat and uh, yeah, okay, back at the island, get my stuff, I don't even know where I died, do I get my things back, oh, I get back three. Might as well see what you have. You've got a mediocre explorer stash. Better than nothing. <sighs> this game can be brilliant, but also really annoying. Because I don't want to have to come back to this. I just want to get it over and done with. And that's it. Okay, I'm back at my base. Um, I'm going to take a little bit of a diversion. Because I couldn't, I couldn't find it couldn't find the tarantula hawks and I had died and I lost my bow and I was not feeling it so I've come back I'm trying to I'm gonna take a little bit of a different tack for the rest of this episode so I'm making wool to um to make two more make two more elevators at least I'm only going to need one though Ah, uh, let's see. No, it's not I. Okay. Right, so do I have... Yes, I do have my blocks. I want those, and I need something to replace it with. Um, Dirt, I guess? Okay, right. Um, It seems like these things... Oh, do I have... I do have. Hold on. It seems like there is no limit. Oh, you know what I need? The exchanger. That would help. Uh, no, not that way. Yeah, the elevators, they don't have a limit in this pack. So I should be able to place one from the top of... Um... The top of 
this this thing to the surface. Hold on. Um, what do I want? I wanted scaffolding, which is in my backpack. Didn't I have more scaffolding somewhere? I had more scaffolding somewhere. In here, no. Yeah, not being able to find the the thing really threw me off, which is a bit weird. Okay, exchanger. That's what I was looking for. Though I don't think I actually need it. No, I don't think I actually need it, to be honest. All right, let's um, let's go outside. Go to the top. So we're there. If we look up, that's where we need to be. That's not what I wanted. All right, it looks like I need to be over one. All right. It's not what I wanted to do. Okay, that's that. Yeah, that looks like that's where we need to be. Okay. Um, ha, it works. It works very well. Right, where's my pick? Ah, uh, nope. Not what I wanted to do. Oh no, no, no. Oh yeah, there's still the elevator. But that's not what I wanted to do. Um... All right, um, maybe I should have made a wand or something. I don't know. And I've got the lightning get glitch again, which is really annoying. Okay, this is better. Okay, um, I've installed uh, elevators. So gone up. So now we have a little island out here. At some point, I'm going to connect it to that island, maybe. I don't know. And also, I've gone down. I'm going to excavate down here at some point. Uh, did I... Mm, backpack, maybe? No? I had dirt. Where did I put the dirt? I don't know what I did with it. But at some point, I'm going to excavate down here. Probably when I have nothing else to do. And I just need to, you know, mine mindlessly. So there's that. Right, so. What am I going to do instead of looking for tarantula hawk stuff because they all seem to have dried up? We're going to make some food stuff because we need food. Okay, so we've done some of the food bit already. I want to make the kitchen. So we've made the cog. We've made the bitter lily buds. We get stuff. Um, we've made the grinder and we get coins. Got the yeast and we get stuff bronze boots okay uh, we made the fermenters and we get xp and we made the water resistant planks and we get a key hub fragment which we don't need but i believe that turns into um coins right uh key fragment yes they turn into coins. 
So that's good. So the fermenter, we get XP. Don't want that. Um, you okay? All right. So I want to go this way. So at least we got a kitchen going, and then I can work on it between episodes. So we want eight fertilized farmland, which is dirt around phyto grow. Phyto grow is fish turd, sand, and sugar. Uh, fish turd, sand, and... Oh! Fish turds and sand gives you brown dye? That's interesting. And that, that gives you phyto grow. How many did we need? I can't remember. Um, and then we want dirt. I oh, know. Um, we need a stack. Okay. Maybe not a stack. Half a stack. I knew that. I was just, you know, checking. All right, so we wanted eight of those. We get doggy treats. Or control for tags. Well, I'll get to that at some point. We'll leave that for now. Cooking for blockheads. We need the cookbook. All right, we've already made the cookbook once. You just take a book and you cook it. And then, yeah, that's what we need, isn't it? You know, I'm saving all these coins and I haven't really bought anything. To be honest, I don't really need to buy anything. And then you put it in the middle of your thing and then we get the cooking for book. Cooking for blockheads, no filter edition. And that basically means if you have food in your inventory, you can cook it, basically. But it's also an integral part of the cooking for blockheads multi-block. Um, okay, so we need to make the cooking table, which is terracotta and stone, and the cooking for blockheads 2 book, which is what we have, right? No, maybe? I don't know. Um, alright, stone, oh, three of those. We want terracotta and okay there there i should have bookmarked it we're missing this one okay two crafting tables two diamonds and the book right two diamonds two crafting tables and the book no is it the other way around Really? It doesn't want... Can we turn it back then? Can I turn that back? Really? <sighs> okay. I'll be right back. Okay, that's done. Oh, that was a quest? Which quest was... Oh, that one. Okay. Yeah, cooking table. Right. The sink provides a constant water source. Ranged pump? Why do we need a ranged pump? Okay, we need a water bucket and iron. Why do we need a pump? That's bugging me. One, two, three. We need a water bucket. So probably we need to make another bucket at some point. Oh, we got back our bucket. That's cool. All right, what's the next thing? Uh, pump. Okay, we did get, uh, we get an enchanted heart. We get cabinets and the sink gives you a pump. This gives you food, nice. This gives you the master treat. Oh, four emeralds, we have four emeralds. I've been trading, I have emeralds. Oh, okay. Um, no, actually, well, doesn't matter. Master treat. Okay. And that gives you stuff that we don't really need. I have barley, right? Okay. I want to see something. If I put these, because it's a multi block, right? If I put these to the back of my multi block structure, can I see the stuff that's in it? 
Okay, the cutting board. I don't know where the cutting board is. It's in there, but it's not seeing it. Okay. Yeah, all of those stuff. All right, if I take those out. All right, the cutting board. There was the grinder. Um, if I just put Pams at Pams. Um, the skillet, bakeware, juicer, saucepan, mixing bowl. Um, I think that was it. I think that was it. All right, so if we take the two kitchen cabinets and put them above with our, um, not the bucket, uh, sausage. Anything else? That. I think that's it. So now, apple juice. It sees it, but it's not seeing. Um, okay, I can get. If I do a search for juice, P8, carrot, apple, cherry juice, will it see that? All right, cherry juice. The cherries are in there, but it doesn't see. It doesn't see everything. All right, if I take the cherries out, where's cherries? Now it sees the cherry juice. Battered sausage. Not seeing the pot. Is the pot in there? And that's because it's not. All right. Um. Did I never make a pot? Yeah. Yeah. Four bricks and a stick. Yeah, right. Four bricks. Stick. Did I not take the stick out? Okay, so we're seeing some stuff. I'm not sure. Hmm, that's interesting. That's interesting. But it does see it, which is good. Because it means that I don't have to pull out everything out of here. I've got all the f oh, it's all the apples which are on some. And it's all the carrots. I wonder if I put kitchen cabinets on this side. All right, let's have a look. All right, we need three maybe. All right, so we want uh, three chests. Actually, let's make four and terracotta. All right, uh, the kitchen cabinets or what? Okay, not seeing much. Oh no, 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 no. Um, come off. Hmm. Why did it turn that way? And where is my um crescent wrench, crescent hammer? Oh, it might be in my toolbox. Where's my toolbox? Mm. Have these two still not lost their professions? That's interesting. Uh, where is my toolbox? I don't know what. Oh, there's my toolbox. I don't know why we've got that stupid lighting glitch. Because, I mean, you can see it's really well lit up, but it just bugs me. All right, what were we doing again? Oh, yeah, crescent hammer. All right, let's put you on the end here. Uh, it's still not seeing very much. Okay. I don't know why it only sees certain things. That's interesting. I don't know, but it's something to think about. All right, I'm gonna have to, I don't know what I'm going to do between episodes, but that's done. We can make drinks, hydrostatic botany pots. Maybe I need to make the oven and the cow in a jar. The oven is the furnace, black stained glass. Do I have any ink, squid ink? No, I'll have to go look for some squids. Oh. All right, we got some squid this way. I really feel like I'm floundering at the moment. I'm not quite sure what I need to do next. Did I kill it? I didn't get any squid ink though. Now, if I was going to get squid ink, it would have gone up and it's not there. All right, uh, another squid, maybe. There you go. We need to make, you know what? I need to make crushing wheels. Are you a piranha? You're a piranha. Where are you? Got it. Um, did I... I've got three squid inks. All right, it's excellent. Did I get the fish turd from the piranha? Okay, we need glass. All right, let's make the cooker. Oh, I need a furnace. Okay, uh, do we have furnaces? Mm, we have a blast furnace. I don't think that's really going to work, though. Uh, cobble. Um... Right. Okay, we've made the oven. Uh, where are we? Here. 
This needs a heat source, like um, coal. Do I have coal? Yes, I do have coal. So then, there's stuff that we could cook and it will show up on the oven. So that's that. And we get some kitchen counters. More space to serve food. Um, so if I put the sausages up here, S A ground fish, U, no, U. I can make battered sausages. Okay. All right, and if I put the battered sausages in here, is there anything I can make with that? I don't know. Anyway, but that's that's enough of that. We got that. Uh, cow in a jar. That's always fun. But it involves me getting a cow. But I think that might be a fun way to end the episode because I need a bit of fun in this episode. So let me go get a cow and I will be back. Okay, um, went to the, what you call it? I went to the oasis, got the cow. All right, we need to put this here. We need to build up some dirt around it. Um, hmm. Can I put you there? No, I should have gotten some wheat. Do I have any? No, I don't. Uh, where's the wheat? Did I take down all the wheat? No. There's oats. Um, did I really move all the wheat? Maybe I did. Okay, ignore that. Uh, I need some wheat. W E A. W E A W H E A T wheat. Okay. Oh, you know what I forgot? Most important thing, the anvil. Okay, right. I feel like I've been recording for hours. I probably have been, to be honest. Yep, you see the wheat. Alright, let's put you there, because that's what we're putting the anvil against. And yeah, that that really helped. Hey, buddy. Wait a minute. Why am I doing it this way? I can... Uh, at least I only spent a couple of minutes trying to get him in it. Um, that's what we want. So he's on top of the thing. Put the anvil on and we get milk in a jar. Or a cow in a jar. And that was that. So I'm going to stop recording now. I'll have to go get another cow at some point, or some sheep, or something. And let's go put this on our countertop. Oh, might help if I actually, um, clear some space. Pickaxe. Um, cow in a jar? Cow in a jar. Pickaxe, uh, da, da, da. Kitchen cabinet. Right. So, thanks very much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe, it really helps grow my channel and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye!